What is up everyone, StonePost34 here, bringing you Owning the Objective. This is a game of domination on firing range. Uh, we're running with the full crew. This is actually a game from last night. I uh, just wanted to put it up, let you know it is a little bit long. Uh, we played a pretty good team. I don't know if they were a team or not. Right here, this is a great grenade. A lot of people I've seen on other YouTube videos try to throw it over the building to my left right there. Um, and I've not had much luck with that. I think I've done it once. Um, but I like to walk through that walkway and uh, toss a flash and a grenade over the top. And I'd say 95% of the time it results in at least one kill and typically first blood. Um, but right now I um, just went through my prestige, trying to set up classes. It just takes a while. Trying to set up classes, buy equipment. I just got the FAMAS. Uh, I think a game or two before this game, uh, you know, you got to buy your claymores. It's it, it makes the game fun. I got to tell you, prestiging. I like the fact that in Black Ops they made it a little bit quicker. I remember Modern Warfare 2 was quite the grind, and um, I think I only prestiged once because I just it wasn't a lot of fun. In this game, it's a little bit more fun because you have gun customization on your own. You just buy what you want. Obviously, you have to wait till you unlock them at certain levels, but Modern Warf Warfare 2 was just, uh, it was just a little bit too difficult and kind of took the fun out of prestiging. So, I got the FAMAS, uh, running dual mags on it, uh, running spy plane, care pack, and you'll see, I'm trying to get Hardline Pro, so I'm, I'm basically sharing all my care packs right now. I wound up getting it later last night. Um... I think, I don't think I use my secondary, but I think it is a, a dual wield handgun. I'm not sure which gun it is. I, I don't use it. That's how important it is, or not important it is, uh, to me in this in this gameplay. But uh, you'll see throughout the gameplay, we're, we're uh, all over the place. They keep capping B and flipping C to A. Um, just makes it a little bit difficult. Um, I, I failed to mention. Spy plane, care pack, and then chopper gunner. I went ahead and bought that early, uh, since that's probably one of my uh, favorite higher kill streaks and one that's uh, easier to get with uh, hardline. Um, but running with the same crew, Texas G-Man, uh, some others. Hey, there's something I want to talk to you guys about. Um, this won't be so much about the gameplay. When we get in groups, we we have a little bit of talk about uh, internet connection, and I'm a bit of a techie. I'm not going to lie, I mean, we've got, <laughs> I think I've got, let's see, three laptops upstairs, two iPads, uh, my server down here on uh, this computer to render video, I've got an old laptop in my closet that has all my music on it, uh, I've got three towers at work that I own, um, so I've always kind of been a, a techie guy, um, I, I do know how to write HTML script. I used to wi write websites, uh, freelance websites. I wrote my own for my company. So I, I know a little bit about the internet, and I gotta tell you, a lot of it is self taught. Uh, my dad's a fiber optic engineer. So, you know, growing up, we were uh, able to learn quite a bit just by hanging out with my dad. But um, what I wanna talk about is internet connection and gaming. And one thing that we talk about uh, just in groups when people are having bad days uh, and we're getting owned on the internet connection, in fact, Only Use Me Blade, he put up a, he put up a video a couple months ago calling it uh, Host Pro. You know, when you, when you get host and uh, you're getting the drop on people just because you are the host and obviously the internet connection doesn't have very far to travel since it's all on your machine. Uh, one of the things I like to tell people when they're they're having difficulty in a game, and you've, you know, you're just having a bad night of gaming. What you want to do, typically, is check how many computers you actually have running on your router. You know, your router is your gateway to, uh, whether it's a cable modem or DSL modem, I don't, you know, whatever you're running on. Your router is the gateway. See, just go ahead, I don't know if you, if you have the passcode or not to get into your router. Just see how many leases you have on that router. What I tell people, easiest way to do it without going through and getting all techy and, and trying to track how many open ports and leases and, you know, we've got a bl wireless Blu-ray player, um, I, we've iPads, my cell phone calls out through my router. Um, I've got all these different applications and devices running off my home router. Easiest thing to do is just go reset it. 
Uh, if you're having a bad day of gameplay, bad night of gameplay, and you feel like your internet connection is um, is the reason for that, or you're you're not getting the drop on people, and you watch your kill cam and you're a half second to a full second behind people, um, you're probably your router uh, is probably having some packet loss, and I'll explain that here. In a <coughs> excuse me, here in a minute. But go ahead and reset it. Go ahead and reset your modem, uh, whether it's cable modem, DSL, whatever you're on. I'm on Uverse. Live in the Midwest. That's a product offered through AT&T. Um, I have the highest um, signal they offer, which is 24 megs down and 3 megs up, and it's pretty darn consistent. It's called a copper to fiber connection. I live about 400 feet from the switch box, which is a fiber optic connection, and then uh, they run it through. From there, they have a device that uh, will sign it send it to your house uh, over copper. So there is some um, distortion, minimal, uh, through the copper copper line. Uh, like I said, this is a little techy, so I'm sorry if you guys are not enjoying this, but I'm just trying to give you some advice on what you can do to improve your online gaming experience. The other thing you want to do, and I'll do th I do this quite a bit, is uh, test my ping. It's ping, P-I-N-G, uh, which is me measured in milliseconds. Um, the lower the number, the better the signal. The higher the number, the worse the signal. Uh, and that basically the ping measures, uh, it pings off a server, that's why it's called ping, it measures the amount of seconds it, for that signal to come back. And then uh, it gives you a quick reference uh, of how wh what the quality of your signal is. And I'll leave a link in the description. Uh, pingtest.net, I think, is uh, the one I use most of the time. Uh, and then also speedtest.net, and I'll leave a link for that too. Um, that will tell you your up and down speed, and also gives you a brief uh, description of what your ping is. It isn't always 100% uh, accurate. Uh, other things that can affect your signal are packet loss. I mentioned that a minute ago. Packet loss is uh, when you connect to your modem, and the data is transmitted to your modem. It's transmitted in packets. Um, just imagine, say you're playing online right now and uh, or you're watching this video online. Uh, your modem is sending out a request to YouTube to pull down this video. Not a big deal because you're not trying to ups, you're not sending a whole lot of information ups. But if you're playing a video game, you're trying to, you know, I'm going left, right, I'm going to fire, crouch, reload. Packet loss is basically information that's sent to your modem uh, through your router and never arrives. So, um, and uh, I should have said earlier, if you didn't know, uh, there's no dedicated servers in Black Ops. Um, in fact, most FPS games, there's not uh, for consoles. So uh, imagine if I'm host and you're, you know, in Indiana and you're trying to tell me that you're crouching, shooting or whatever, and it arrives, but late because it never actually arrived the first time. So that will cause some latency, some lag. Uh, and you'll see it in a kill cam, basically. You're, you're going to feel like, oh my god, what happened? Uh, I should have killed that guy. I, I had a whole clip in him, and uh, I turned around, I got shot once, and I'm dead. You know, that's that's what happens. So one other thing I wanted to mention, I do speed this up, because this is a long game, and uh, I didn't want to have to render 12 minutes of video. Uh, another thing I want to mention, I hope that you are on a wired connection. Please do not use the wireless function, especially for this game. Uh, there are several things that can cause interference uh, with that. Uh, microwaves, if your mom or your wife or your girlfriend's up nuking some popcorn watching a movie, that's going to distort your signal. You're going to have issues there. Um, you know, basically, a uh, wireless modem takes a radio signal and then has to convert it uh, into an internet signal. So you're going to have some distortion, some information loss there. But just some tips on it. You know, I can talk more about it if you guys have questions about it. Email me. I'm certainly not. I'm sure there's smarter people out there than me. And like I said, I've never, never had real formal training on this. This is a lot of self-taught stuff, but um, I hope that helps you. I'd say, number one, if you're having issues, make sure uh, to go and reset your router. That's the quickest and easiest thing I can offer you guys. Um, it works for me. Uh, re resets all the leases on it, but hey, thanks guys. The game's wrapped up, finished 53, 23, two caps, and five defense. Uh, please subscribe, uh, give it a like if you don't mind, and as always, thanks for watching. Take care, this is Stonepost34.